In this SAT problem, we're asked to find the domain of a function that contains a quadratic expression under a square root. Let's solve. Remember, the square root of a negative number is not defined in real numbers. So we need the expression inside the root to be greater than or equal to 0. Let's factor it. An x minus 2 times x minus 3 is greater than or equal to 0. Now we use a sign chart to determine where this expression is positive. First, find the critical points by setting each factor to 0. We get x equals 2 and x equals 3. This divides the number line into three intervals, negative infinity to 2, between 2 and 3, and greater than 3. We'll test the number from each interval. In the first interval, try x equals 1. 1 minus 2 times 1 minus 3 is minus 1 minus 2 is positive. In the second interval, try x equals 2.5. 2.5 minus 2 times 2.5 minus 3, it's 0 0.5 times negative 0 0.5 equals negative. In the third interval, try x equals 4. 4 minus 2 times 4 minus 3 is positive. Since we're looking for values where the expression is greater than or equal to 0, so it is x less than c equal 2 or x doesn't c equal to 3. That is option B. Follow for more SAT math questions and strategies.